What's up everybody? My name is the Melting Man and welcome to a really 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 cool game. This is Alice Madness Returns. I think this might be a sequel to something called Alice or whatever, but uh, it's a game I've tried to play for years. I first got it when I was still on my laptop and every time I'd try to beat it some other game would come out or my laptop would break. So uh, just like a couple of games we've seen before, I have played it up to a point. So yeah, let's get going. When I was a young boy. No, it seemed like that was how it was gonna start. Oh, okay. oh, oh. Um. So, like most Alice in Wonderland games, it's based around the classic tale of Alice in Wonderland. The premise behind this is it's way more adult. Alice is insane. Um, there might be a little bit of a callback to the previous game, but uh, as far as I can remember, not much. She's gone insane. She's gone through this horrible trauma. Um, and so there's this thing where Wonderland may or may not be real. Yeah, there's this whole thing. It was terrible trauma. Her family died in a fire. Um, I think she may have already visited Wonderland and shit went down. Um, but the overwhelming consensus is that this is a better game, whether or not you've played the first one. Or first instance of this story. With a friend. Hmm. It's different somehow. Things have changed. Change is good. First link in the chain of forgetting. What's happening? Are you mad? I'm not mad. Rabbit. That's not right. What's he doing? Is something wrong? Something wrong? Rob! Oh no! Not that! Don't struggle, Alice. Let the new Wonderland emerge. This is super creepy. Corruption? It, it's killing me! Wonderland is destroyed! Forget it, Alice. Block that dream. Wake at the sound. What the fuck? <laughs> it really has been a while since I played this. I don't remember how this cutscene started. My head's exploded and there's a steam hammer in my chest. Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. My memories make me vomit. What can I... Remember other things. I want to forget. Who would choose to be alone, imprisoned by their broken memories? I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. So you've said many times, and... And I will say again, the past must be paid for. Now, before our next session, collect those pills from our high street chemist. Very well, Doctor. No, no, thank you, no. That's so fu- Oh my god, that's so fucking freaky. That is this- No, no, no. Fuck! Oh, they're so erratic and disgusting, no. My stars and garters, Alice Little. What the fuck happened? Nurse Witless. What luck. Twice in his pants. Out on your You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come <sighs> along home then and look at my pigeons. Yeah. <laughs> I know it's worth more than that. It's a very strange feeling to play a game that you know you've played considerably up to a point and then replay it years later and just feel like, oh, I know this. Wait, no. No, I don't know this. Wait, wait, no. Wait. It's very strange. It's like I'm sort of remembering 
the plot, kind of, but not really. It's fucking weird. She yells and goes off her head. This she cannot remember her name, what I heard. Yeah, um, now that I think about it, like, this lady, her, like, it's super cool, like, in the beginning, it makes you seem like, yeah, Wonderland is obviously real, like, Alice, you know, physically goes to Wonderland, or maybe it's somewhere in her head, <coughs> but eventually, it starts making you think that, like, she's made it up, or, like, it's a defense mechanism, or, like, this is real, and Wonderland is not, it's very interesting. I have a thirst you could photograph. Need a drink. Your mouth only needs water. Um, stop being a jerk. Uh, we should just go. Pretty like you. This is so fucking weird. It's only a dream. Yeah! And she turns into Alice. Like, Alice in Wonderland Alice. It's super cool. I'm excited to play this. Uh, a game is coming out that will probably get in the way of us continuing something. But uh, I'll make sure to keep um, playing consistent games. But I'm really excited to finish this one with you guys. Because I've always wanted to. But I've never gotten around to it. So yeah, here we are. Wonderland. The very real place that Alice goes to when she's stressed out. Very upsetting journey. But I'm rid of Pris or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. About time, too, Alice. Blasted cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. You're no help at all. What? But you know I can be. I'll frighten myself when necessary, thanks very much. It's like a seventh grader doing, doing the writing for the that. Cheshire Cat. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all You gotta... We're at risk here. Right. You, if you be on just, your guard. Right. You know what? Never mind. Never mind. Just be a cat. So check it out. Look how cool this place is. It's full of, like, a lot of really cool detail. And, like, knickknacks and beautiful, like, unique plant life and weird, disgusting shit monsters like that. It's a wonderful take on Alice in Wonderland. I'm still playing with this graphically because um, it's kind of an older game. That and EA's stink is all over it. So it's like not really optimized well for like higher end rigs or just in general. Like I think it was a console game to begin with. I can't remember. But um, as you can see, things are kind of jumpy and kind of choppy. And I'm still tinkering with it, but I just wanted to start the game so you guys can see this and how fucking cool it is. And, like, because, you know, we've all seen, like, a hundred thousand billion zillion interpretations of Alice in Wonderland. I think this is one of the coolest, and I really wanted to share it with you guys. My God, I'm shrinking in this potion. Shall I disappear? Almost. But the upside is that while smaller, you can see things that are nearly invisible to your bigger self. Ah, I get it. Right. Forests for the trees. Just the other way round. Short-sighted is more than a matter of perspective. Yeah, it's a little shrinky potion that I can do at any time I want. And it shows me a little dinker doos. Oh god, yeah. I forgot, you collect teeth. <laughs> like, teeth. And they make a weird, weird, 
really uncomfortable, unsettling, like, crunching noise when you collect them. It's very weird. This is, this is not just, like, okay. Um. Yeah. This is not just some, like, oh, uh, like, edgy. Blah, blah, blah. This is, like, nightmare fuel, Alice. This is, like, this is, like, if, uh, some director that you're familiar with who does dark movie stuff got a hold of it. Insert name now. Alfred Hitchcock, Stanley Kubrick, Billy Wilder, Woody Allen, David Lee, and William Wyler, Orson Welles, Charlie Chaplin, Roman Polanski, Preston Sergis, Martin Scorsese, Michael Powell, Ernst Lupich, Francis Ford Coppola, Frank Capra, David Lynch, Justin Huston, Fritz Lang, Elia Kazin, Quentin Tarantino, Terrence Malick, Mike Nichols, George Cooker, Robert Altman, Joseph L. Manischewitz, uh, Cecil B. DeMille, John Cassavetes, Michael Coates, D.W. Griffith, Douglas Stirk, Vincent Minnelli, Arthur Penn, John Ford, Joel Cohn, Ridley Scott, Steven Spielberg, Howard Hawks, James Cameron, Brian De Palma, Robert C. <laughs> this is what upset me the most. Like, that right there? That's a jabberwocky. The vorpal blade is swift and keen and always ready for service. This is my favorite part about this game. Like, you know, that's a that's like an acid trip of a poem and I'm an acid trip of a story. A fight. Really? That's oh, a man. But, like, the vorpal blade is always, like, interpreted different ways. And I just love how in this, in this version, it's just a big-ass butcher knife. Like, covered in those engravings and shit and... It's just so crazy that, like, you just, you get it with, like, oh, no big deal, it's a dead Jabberwocky, no fucking big deal. Yeah! Look at that shit! Oh, it leaves all that cool trail and shit, and it goes, shwing, shing, 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 shing! Shit, I forgot some. Steven Spielberg, Howard Hawks, James Cameron, Brian De Palma, Robert Zemeckis, George Lucas, Otto, Otto per Preminger, I don't know. Oliver Stone, Spike Lee, Sam Pettenbaugh, Tim Burton, Peter Jackson, Mel Brooks, Clint Eastwood, and Sam Raimi. Those are directors. I mean, like I said, the game's not optimized very well, so you'll be seeing some small graphical changes as we play along. But one thing I really enjoy is Alice's hair. Like, it, it moves very realistically, and it, like, settles on her shoulders very well. I just, I really enjoy details like that, even if it doesn't really affect the game. Um, I just, I think it's really cool. Or, like, how her walk animation changes slightly with the, with the Warble Blade in hand. Like, at such a distance that it won't touch her. And, like, her run, I, let me, I, it's a stupid detail, but I like it. Anyway, here's the shit monsters that are in... It was a weird noise. But yeah, it, the fucking um, monsters in this game are really freaky. Ah, it's you again, Alice. You may approach. Why would I do that? You want to eat me? Yes, well, you taught me manners. And I've lost my taste for mad women. Strictly a poor sign diet for me. Everything's better with bacon, don't you agree? Of course you do. Now, there are pig snouts scattered about. I heard a few behind the house. Go fetch them for <sighs> me. But take care for the pests that block your way. Pepper them up if they do. They need spice. And you're just the dear a girl to season them for me. You'll find that grinder serviceable. Why not season your own pig parts? Matter of priorities. My alabaster skin needs protection from the disgusting creatures running amok amidst the environs. But one gets peckish. Look, all you have to do is listen for the oink, then shoot the snout. You may like the results. I certainly will. Ugh. You are just a nightmare to look at. Alright, so we got uh, the Duchess's Pepper Grinder. It's our long-range weapon. Pretty cool, huh? Anyway, I think I've had enough just eye destruction for one day. 
We'll pepper these horrific pig snouts for this ho just shit person, the Duchess, next time. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Don't forget that I love you. And, you know, I'm the melting man.